Welcome Aquarius and Cross Watchers. This is your general love reading. Aquarius, I feel like this is a twin flame, but I feel like you're in separation from your twin because of a third party and you're single. So stick around. Let's see where this goes. Aquarius, let's get into your energy and then we'll get into the energy of all 12 signs and we'll get you some oracle cards and then get into your spread. So with that, Holy Spirit, Angel, Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance for Aquarius, please. Aquarius, you're looking at something with a different mindset, but it's causing you a lot of stress. So Holy Spirit, Angel, Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance for Aquarius. What is the energy of all 12 signs around Aquarius, starting with Aries, please. If you're dealing with an Aries, somebody is being strategic about working on something. If you're dealing with a Taurus, um, someone's obsessed with regret. And if you're dealing with a Gemini, somebody is waiting for equal give and take. If you're dealing with a Cancer, somebody's walking away from the past. If you're dealing with a Leo... Um, there's somebody acting like a player and it's causing a lot of strife, jealousy, and competition. If you're dealing with a uh, Virgo, um, the the emperor, um, Libra, I feel like that this emperor is with um, a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio, um, or a Libra, Aquarius. I feel like Virgo is with um, the divine masculine is with a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. So if you're dealing with a Libra, someone's holding back um, Empress energy. If you're dealing with a um, Scorpio, I feel like someone's being di divinely guided towards a relationship. If you're dealing with a Sagittarius, um, someone's not speaking because of betrayal. If you're dealing with a Capricorn, someone needs strength for their happiness, strength and courage for happiness. And if you're dealing with another Aquarius, I feel like somebody wants to rush in and speak the truth that they want to be with that per be with somebody. So they want to be with you. And if you're dealing with a um, Pisces, there's an ending so something new can begin and somebody's either uh, confused or daydreaming. Um, but there's also options and illusions here as well that, that could have caused that ending. Okay, Aquarius, your energy is trying to look at something with a different mindset, but it's causing you anxiety. Holy Spirit, Angel, Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance for Aquarius, please. Okay, so I feel like you're, the hard times are over and you're looking forward to happiness. I feel like you got the star and the lover, so, or love. So I feel like you want to heal some love here. Want to heal love. Your fulfillment, leadership. Okay, fulfillment and leadership here. New beginnings of passion. Energy is gaining momentum. The commitment is being tested. Okay, transformation, but you're being protected by all four, in all four directions. Faraway places get ready to for new horizons and the beginning a new cycle. So you may be moving somewhere. But I feel like you want to heal love and you'll have a new beginning of passion. 
and it's gaining momentum but i feel like you you're being tested here good luck uh your luck will soon change and um imagination may cloud your judgment don't let your imagination run away with you in this situation divine feminine purge one flame woo okay so you're you may put you may be putting at things something at a pause for a minute This is about a twin flame journey here, wanting to heal something. But I feel heartbreak and pain, separation, deception, shocking attack, self-indulgence, focus on self, self-worth, time to heal, shadow work, and self-appreciation. So I feel like that's what's going on. Somebody wants to heal. This may have been, you may be in separation. Um, they Maybe you're doing the shadow work that you, you know, you got to purge something. you got to let go of something. Divine feminine energy for this twin flame journey. I feel like, though, your luck is going to change, but don't let your judgment um, run away with you in this situation. Um, because I do see new beginnings here and, you know, possibly moving in a new direction. But something's being transformed that you're being protected. Okay, this is the energy is gaining momentum and your commitment is being tested. So, you know, you you have to um, de make this decision to heal this. Um, I feel like passionate new beginnings is coming. But, you know, leadership standing in your um, this is your fulfillment leadership. You are um, you're if you're the divine feminine, you are a leader here. So this is your fulfillment. You'll get fulfillment out of this whatever this is and as well as um i feel like you need to you're, you're wanting to heal this love because this is your divine partner holy spirit angel spirits and guides clarity and guidance for aquarius what does aquarius need to know please Okay, so I feel like you're at a crossroads about justice here, working on something. You're manifesting. It's causing a tower. Uh, whatever you're manifesting, causing a tower, needing to recover and to have this new passionate beginning. I feel like that emperor, um, strife, jealousy, and competition caused the betrayal. I've got to clarify why the sun is next to the betrayal um, because there's burden here that someone's getting clear about. So let me clarify that sun card. Get to it. Okay, so I feel like you're, that someone may apologize uh, because of a choice and wanting to win at all costs, imp uh, Empress energy. Okay, you have the divine feminine, divine masculine here making a decision. Uh, maybe. Um, like there's a two so this is about option someone was juggling an option causing discontent that's why this person's single that's why she's single so you're making a decision you're making a decision being divinely guided out in the cold to justice um you might want to overcome obstacles to have equal give and take you're manifesting him and him mastering his emotions um, it's causing you a lot of anxiety. That anxiety is causing this tower to fall in this relationship. I feel like you want to heal something um, and, and reconcile, but there was an ending so something new could begin. And then there's, there's, there is communication about starting over and having a new beginning, but I feel like um, it's still a choice. You're being patient with this emperor or the emperor's being patient. Um, the strife, jealousy, and competition has moved on, okay? But there is still betrayal here and somebody's needing to look at something with a different mindset where a family situation is. Um, but I feel like their happiness is over, like their happiness has ended. And somebody feels very burdened and they're being strategic, not showing emotion. That could be you, Aquarius, uh, wanting to move forward, not speaking. Um, because the clarity of a new beginning 
um, you still feel up in your head, trapped and needing strength. But I feel like there is, you know, someone may come and apologize to you. Well, it doesn't really matter at this point. There's an option, a choice between two where somebody wanted to win at all costs. The Empress, what is the Empress doing? The Empress needs to heal. She needs to heal and she's speaking the truth. Okay, so somebody was juggling a third party and it caused a lot of discontent. That's why this person's single, because of deception, holding, on, holding back and taking a leap of faith. And it took a long time. So somebody, okay, no, this is not what that is. Okay, so here, this person's single because of the juggling, okay? There's, there's deception and somebody's holding back from committing. They're, they're holding back from committing and it's taken a long time because of a third party situation. With the Queen of Cups, a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio relationship. Um, Aquarius, I feel like you are single and abundant and you're fine. You need to heal from this. Your divine masculine may have cheated on you with a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. Take it out, resonates with you. Um, but it, they're up in their emotions about the relationship, that's for sure. Um, that's all I have for you. If this resonates with you, please leave me a comment down below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hope you have a wonderful week.